Okay, so I'm going to do a couple of examples. In both of these examples, we're given an initial point and a terminal point of a vector. And we want to write the vector in terms of uh, i and j. Okay, so let's do that. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to use the formula, right? So how do I write a vector? It's a linear combination, what we call a linear combination of the scalar multiples of the unit vectors, the unit component vectors i and j. So then that means in this case v is going to equal what? x2 minus x1 times what? i plus y2 minus y1 j. That's it. That's all you have to remember. So again, this is, the, this is the initial point, this is the terminating point. So again, make sure you know which is which. So I'm going to do x1, so that's going to be negative 6 minus 2 times i plus 6 minus a negative 6 j, and now I just simplify. So this is going to be negative 8 i plus or minus 12 j. And I'm done. Or oh, I'm sorry, hold on. Not minus, this is plus. Minus, minus, that's going to be plus. Okay. And that's it. So that's all they want you to do. That's, this is, that's all they ask us to do until we're done. There's nothing more to do. So let's do the same thing here. Same formula, right? So now let's call this u. Okay? So now again, this is the initial point, terminating point. And again, I'm using the formula. x2 minus x1 times i plus y2 minus y1 times j. And so now, it's going to be x2, so that's 2 minus a negative 1. 2 minus, oops, not 2. 2 minus a negative 1 times i plus 7 minus 3j. And so now I just simplify it. So this is going to give me 3i plus 4 J. And so now I can easily plot these, right? Because what does this tell me? This is telling me that I'm going eight, negative eight units in the I direction, which means in the horizontal direction. So that means I'm going eight units to the left. This is telling me 12 units in the J direction, which is up and down. So this is going to be up. So this is telling me that my point, my vector ends in the, uh, as far as standard position, starts at the origin and ends in the second quadrant. This one here is in the first quadrant. I'm doing three units to the right, four units up. Okay? That's it. That's true. That easy. Have a good day.